Hello Zebra Herd, welcome back to Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Today, we are going back into classic mode and checking out yet another new character. Last episode, we checked out Ness, and now we'll be moving on to, I believe, Captain Falcon. Let me double check my list real fast. Yeah, Captain Falcon. So I actually really like this guy. I've been having a lot of fun with him in World of Light, and now we're here checking him out in Captain Falcon round up close and personal. As you can see, he has a couple of different skins, just sort of different colorations. I don't think any of them are really referential to anything. Ooh, I like that golden one though. That one's pretty cool. Yeah, they're pretty cool. This one's sort of like an inverse. No, it's not even an inverse. This one looks almost exactly the same. Huh, weird. Um, but yeah, this is what we'll be using. Of course, the normal one. We'll hop into it. The thing about Captain Falcon is he's very fast. He's very, very hard hitting. And since I played a little bit yesterday, I think I will try for like a five. Oh, well, let me get higher than five. Can you not start higher than an intensity of five? Or maybe since I've never done higher than this, I can't go any higher. We'll try five, we'll see how it goes, and hopefully everything turns out okay. Up close and personal. And before we take on Donkey Kong, let me go ahead and take a look at our move list. For Captain Falcon, we have the Falcon Punch, which is his, his neutral special, powers up for a moment, then strikes with a flaming punch, can change, or, yeah, can change direction while charging, which is a pretty big move. Not too many uh, different charge-ups can do that. We have the Raptor Boost, which is his side special, charges forward to hit foes with an uppercut, can be used in midair to meteor foes downward. We have the special up, or the up special, Falcon Dive, jumps up to grab foes and explodes to send them flying. And then finally we have the down special, Falcon Kick. So slides forward with a flaming kick while on the ground and a diagonal kick in the air. And then finally we have the final smash, Blue Falcon. The Blue Falcon races directly in front of the captain, striking opponents and launching them to a racetrack where he can run them down. Because of course he is from the F-Zero series, a game I've never played, but I've heard is quite good. It's sort of like a racing game, sort of like Mario Kart in a way, but also totally not, so <laughs> take that as you will. Um, but yeah, I'll do what I can here. And what's weird is that I guess like, this, this is one of the few classic modes where it doesn't seem to have too much to do with the character's story. It's more about how the character plays. Oh, that is so cool. Well, see you, DK. Well, can I hit you when you're in that? Oh, you bet I can. But man, oh man, does he hurt. Like, he is tough to go against. You have to know what you're doing. And he's sort of gotten me out of a lot of sticky situations so far in the stream. Oh, baseball bat, baseball bat. No, wait, no, wait, I wanna go down. Thank you. And then, mm, get over here. Oh, wait, what happened? Oh, he threw the pal block. Stop. Oh, there it is, see ya. But that's sort of like, I talked a little bit about this with Ness last episode, where Smash Bros gave Ness a lot of his personality, not to say he didn't have it in his own game, but in the way that Ness didn't really have a voice, Smash gave it to him. That can be said extremely so for Captain Falcon as we go against Ganondorf here, um, is that, ooh, oh, okay, not quite, not quite. Ooh, nice move. Um, is that Captain Falcon didn't really have any kind of persona outside of his race car at this point, like in his series. And, oh, that nice, okay, very good. Cat, the Super Smash Bros gave Captain Falcon like a voice, a look, a move set. Like he wasn't really a character outside of his car, so like how would he fight? What would it look like? And that is really cool that they were able to pull that off in their very original N64 game, and it's been a very popular character since and going against Ryu. But we're going against some very strong physical fighters, which I think that, you know, Captain Falcon embodies a lot, especially with his like, Falcon Punch. It's like one of the most popular moves in Smash Bros. Oh, oh, I wanna do it. Okay, that wasn't quite it. But I love him. Like, he's probably one of my favorite fighters to play so far. And you know, like, I've been struggling to find characters I can really stick with and like can play really well through thick and thin. But I think Captain Falcon is one of them. And we're tearing him up so far. We've gotten like, what, three or four battles done now? In excellent succession, yeah, that was stage three. Nice place, we're at 7.0 already. This is gonna get start, starting to get real nasty, I'm sure. So let's try this out against Roy. Oh, okay. Let's see if he gets over here. Oh man, I love that. Where's he going? Nah, it's not gonna work. Oh geez. I don't like when this map does that, but it does do that. Okay, get down this way. Hold on. Oh, nice. I love when you can connect with that special. It just, there's something so satisfying about it. I think he's definitely one of the most satisfying characters and you can tell I like him a lot. <laughs> but I mean, he's one of the few characters I've actually had the chance to get used to in World of Light before the character showcase so far. He's tearing me up right now though. Mmm, that was good, that was good. No, that missed. Ooh, 
Will that, uh, that won't quite, no it will, nice, awesome. See, this is, there's so much to love about him. I don't think that was a nice play. No, it was a nice play. Okay, so we get .7 out of that one. We're seeing more of the mural than we ever have. How exciting is that? Let's keep moving. And we're going to get some knee brawler. Three of them, actually. Gonna make things a little bit more complicated. Oh, and there goes one of them. Oh, is it an army? It is. Okay, one of them's dressed up as a ribbon girl. Um, whoa, ooh, ooh. hold on. What is his down, is his down smash? I don't know, it seems to be just like a recovery of a weird thing. Okay, maybe now's not the time to experiment. See ya. Okay. Whoa, 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 hold on, hold on. My other going up quite a lot here. Gotta be careful. Jeez, they are tearing me up right now. I gotta be real careful. Wait, this got tough fast. No, he got me, darn it. Okay, that's fine, it's fine. I mean, honestly, I'm at a higher intensity than I've ever been. So, I'm pretty proud I've even just been able to get here. Uh, but that Falcon Punch is not easy to time, but I'm gonna be trying for it. Last episode, or last showcase with Ness, we were able to get, okay, Spring Man, get out of here. We were able to get really close to uh, winning a couple games. We did better than I thought we would. There were some fun techniques mixed in there, and I'm hoping that we can get, you know, even better with Captain Falcon. I mean, Captain Falcon, the thing about him is that he's so simple in a lot of ways. Like, in like a good way. Like like his punches and stuff, Like it's there's not any kind of crazy techniques with it. It's just kicking people's butts. And honestly, I feel like I really need that in this game. It's like there's no strategy except for land your shots and play well, you know? Okay, ooh, ooh, I bounced off the ropes. Yeah, he does have like a downward kick, but it does definitely like have a second. Okay, we'll watch it. Oh, I'm getting beat up by the Kukos. Who are the Kukos after, me or him? I don't know. It seems like both of us, <laughs> they're mad at both of us right now. Okay, okay, hold on. The Kukos are done. Oh, he did it too. Maybe it wasn't all that special then. There we go, that was good. Mmm, how did that miss? Okay, okay, little Mac. Hold on for a second here. Don't throw that at me. Thank you. Oh, he's got his KO, I ought to be careful here. No, 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 he's got me. Oh, jeez. No, 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 hold on. Oh, I'm gonna run the wrong way now. What? No, I don't know if my attacks are flipped or is it just? Oh, I want that. I'm not gonna be able to get it with this darn mushroom. Come on. Okay, now it's off, it's off, it's off. Ooh, ooh. Okay, don't get knocked out for it though. No, wait. Come on, get over here. Got it. Oh, and I didn't even need it. Dang it. Oh, well. <laughs> I was about to use it. Look at him. Oh, he's so cool. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Have you ever played an F-Zero game before? And what are your thoughts on Captain Falcon and Smash? We're doing the uh, bonus game up close and personal, as per usual. Okay. So I'm just gonna get over here. I'm gonna try to move as fast as I can. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter too much for this part. Oh, not bad, not bad. I'm gonna ignore this. See, this is where it gets tough. Okay, not exactly what I wanted. But if it works, it works. Why can't I get up here? Uh, Captain, <laughs> I don't know what's going on with that part. Uh, can I make it? Oh, I made it! Oh, I almost got squished though. I've never made it up here, this is great! Okay, go quick, go quick. Wait, what? Did I mess that up? How am I supposed to get up here? I don't know how to get up to that little segment still. Okay, I thought that was gonna be it. Oh well, we're definitely gonna get a higher score than what we normally do, I think. Yeah, we broke 100,000, that's definitely my highest score yet. Pretty cool. New record for me. Okay, so we're going against Bowser. He's the final boss, is it gonna be Giga Bowser maybe? I don't know. Ready? No, it's just Bowser. It has to be like Master Hand afterwards. Like this is weird. Um, here. Oh, you just blocked it. Look at you. Oh, you're not blocking that one. That was good, that was good. Thought I could finally land one of those. Oh, okay, not good, not good. Oh, he just falls on me. Oh, that's so interesting. All right, hold on. Nice. Hold on, whoa, okay, he's starting to tear me up something fierce here. What is going on in the background? I don't know if that's some, like an environment thing that's gonna start attacking us soon. Ooh, ooh, stop. I don't like this, this is scary. Sound effects are really cool though. Come on. Ooh, not bad. Oh, he recovered from it. Oh gosh. Oh no, ooh, ooh. He's good, he's really good. Oh gosh. All right, get back in, what is he doing? Stop that. 
No, no, no. Oh, man, I tried to do something about this. <laughs> I like how he just holds his hands out. Like, no, no, no. No, you don't. Oh, come on. That is really tough to do something about. I'm just gonna keep doing it to you if you'll let me. He's pretty good at blocking my moves, which is not good. Jeez, he's really good at that. I mean, that's sort of something, is that Captain Falcon really, really telegraphs his moves. Oh, no, you don't. That was nice. Nah, that wasn't gonna work. <laughs> what are you doing? Hold on. Mm. Whoa, we're both flying. We're both flying. Oh, what? Did he deflect that? Not good. He's really tough, but that was gonna get him. Okay, but now I have to deal with Master Hand, don't I? With like 121%. Ooh, what is happening? Oh no. Oh no, <laughs> now he's Giga Bowser. And I still have 121. Oh, maximum tomato. Give it to me. Whoa, 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 whoa. That didn't give me a full restore. Oh, that's lame. I don't know how, I think maximum tomatoes might only give you health until you get hit again, which is a total shame if that's the case. Because, ow, there's no way I'm surviving this again. I'm gonna have to use another respawn because like, what the heck do I do against this? Come on. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on, hold on. I got you halfway down already, actually. I'm doing pretty good. Ah, but then he did that. That was weird. I was sort of to his side for him to hit me with that one. All the way down to 6.4 right now. That's bad. Come on, don't you dare. I'm just gonna keep hitting you. Now I'm gonna... Oh, boy. There we go. Wait, I tried to change directions there. It didn't work. What? Game, you lied to me earlier. There we go, we got him. Awesome. <laughs> Jeez, that is so tough, though. Bowser put up a good fight with that one, but that was still a ton of fun. So we went against like a lot of like close range fighters, you know, that was sort of the up close and personal idea with it. And I think that is super duper cool. One of the few classic modes we've ran into, or maybe the only one that doesn't really have anything to do with his game or his story or his character, more his character's play style. But still, I loved it and I love Captain Falcon in this game. Still, I've never played an F-Zero game. Maybe one day they'll release one for the Switch and if so, I'll definitely check it out. Maybe I'll check out some of the older ones. I do have the, uh, SNES Classic, which I think there's an F-Zero game on that one. But yeah, let me know your thoughts on Captain Falcon as a character you think is good, bad, somewhere in between, and if you have any advice for me when it comes to playing him, I would love to hear all about it. Let's go ahead and try to explore all this stuff as fast as I can. Really just wanna try to get through, get all of our credits. But yeah, I've had a lot of fun with him for sure. It is very interesting. Go ahead and bust all this stuff. Come on, go, go, go. Got it. And I think that if there's any character I'm pretty close to maining, I think it's still Princess Peach, but shortly, you know, after that, it's probably Captain Falcon. Not to say that like, oh, I'm the best with Captain Falcon, nobody can beat me. But it's more like, he's the only one I can play some amount good with. Like, it's him and Princess Peach I usually try to play when I feel like I'm in a bit of a sticky situation. And that might change as I play more characters and check them out and learn them a bit more. That's the whole point on why I really want to showcase every single character is I really want to learn for myself which character I would like. Because I think a lot of people have to in Smash Ultimate already knowing what they like know about Smash Bros and are a little bit more advanced with it. And I'm just like a total newbie. But a lot of people, you know, are hopping into it not for the first time. They already know what characters they like, so they can already figure that out. But I'm not really that kind of person. I haven't played too much Smash. I don't really know which characters I really am gonna be good with, especially since I'm just not very familiar with too many fighting games. And the ones I ha have played, I haven't played in like years, I'm not very good with them. And if you guys saw my uh, Dragon Ball Fighter Fighters series back in the beginning in 2018, <laughs> you can know that I'm not very good at fighting games. Oh gosh. I mean, some people have been requesting that I turn up the difficulty for World of Life, but I feel like it's absolutely not something I'm doing anytime soon, because I've just gotten my butt kicked so bad and so often in World of Life. I just don't see how I can turn the difficulty up right now. Maybe at some point, once I get a little bit better and get more characters I can work with, who knows. Okay, let's grab all this. We're doing pretty well right now. We're about to get our last little token. All we need is a couple more things to be broken. Got it, skip it all, skip it all. I don't know if it's possible to do anything sooner than that. <laughs> Look at this Captain Falcon trying to impress the ladies. That is really silly. <laughs> I love that. And he's all in pink gear. I don't know where they are, what map that is. Anyways, very weird. <laughs> Let's keep moving. Our final results, of course, five credits. We get Captain Falcon, the fighter spirit, and what is our normal spirit is Gangrel. Who's that from? Maybe a Fire Emblem or something, looks like it. Uh, let's go ahead and look at our spirit details. Yeah, definitely Fire Emblem. He has electric attack up, not bad. And we get a classic ticket too. That's always good, right? 
Hopefully. And, ooh, a new foe has appeared. Oh, I love this guy. He is super cool. Another guy who drives around in like a spaceship kind of thing. Oh my gosh. I love Falco. He's my favorite out of the group of like Star Fox team guys. Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna be very good against him. He's super speedy. Like I think he's sort of like Fox, but has his own little flares to him. Mmm. But not enough flares apparently. No, that's not gonna work. He's gonna hide from me. Oh, just out of the range of that, but I was able to land the, the, the Falcon Punch. Oh, that is great, so we unlock Falco. Yeah, we hit the Falcon Punch on Falco. Joins the battle, very cool. I am so glad about that. It's gonna be a while until we showcase him, but that was well worth it to unlock somebody like that. See, I had a ton of fun with that one, but we're not quite done with the action in today's episode. I want to, while I have a character I'm pretty familiar with, check out our challenger's approach, try to unlock some new fighters we messed up on previously, like Shulk kick, kicked our butt. I don't remember who we played as, but he just tore us up. So let's try to go ahead and get Shulk unlocked as well, since I've been needing to do it. And Captain Falcon, he's so cool. So I think we're, yeah, we're going back on Gower Plane. Ah, oh, man, the way he just like rides in on a ship and everything. They will try to do his final smash. He's just standing here. Okay. Um, Come on, come over here. See ya. What the heck was that? Why wasn't it that easy in the first try? Shulk joins the battle. Is there any others? Yes, we do have more challengers approaching. This one is not Bayonetta, but looks like Bayonetta from the silhouette. It's, uh, what's her name? Challengers approach, I love that. I love the announcer in this game, he's pretty cool. My imitation is flattery, if you, if you haven't noticed. Uh, oh, there we go, whoa! Yeah, apparently you guys have been letting me know that all the Fire Emblem characters can do that kind of deflect, which is scary. I don't like it, no, 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 what? Ah, I tried to dodge backwards, that was very weird. I don't know if I clicked the button in all the way. Okay, who do I get now? Oh, I get Wario. <laughs> Let's try Wario then. I'm still playing so risky. I think we're gonna be playing on that WarioWare map. Well, there's more than one, that's sort of the thing. We have such a big selection of characters now, it's so cool. I mean, I know a lot of people have been giving this game flack for its unlocking characters, but honestly, I love it. I really like it. Okay, whoop. There we go, got the first bit of damage on him. And then, yeah, that's gonna miss. No one to dare try to charge an attack on me. I'm gonna do it right back at you. Whoa, whoa, don't throw motorcycles at me. Oh, I just hit your motorcycle. It's in the way. Can you stop this? Dodge, no dodging. Don't eat the motor, I didn't know you could do that. Whoa, whoa, shark. Oh, see you, Wario. <laughs> wait, wait, there's a, wait, why was there a floor there? That doesn't make any sense. Whoa, what are you doing? He hit his first bit of damage on me. Oh, how did that miss you? That one didn't, and then, oh, I didn't quite get it. That's fine, that's fine. Whoa, no, no, no. Come on. Jeez, he's tough right now. This is like a real battle going on. <laughs> Isn't like Shulk. Jeez, come on, stop. No, you don't, you're turning this around on me. Stop eating your motorcycle. Oh, 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 no, 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 I pressed jump, what the heck, why does he get an invisible floor, but I don't? That's baloney. Oh my gosh, come on, I'm gonna beat up Ridley. Taking my anger out on you, buddy. Jeez, that stinks, what the heck? I don't like that map. Okay, Captain. Let's get to it. Ah, uh, nor fair, more like no fair. <laughs> That's a really bad joke. Okay. No, 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 hold on. I'm trying to dodge him. What are you doing? I'm the only one who's taken damage so far and I don't like it, so you take some damage now, buddy. Ooh, nice connection there. Oh. Oh, I love that kick. That is so cool, the down. I think it's the down smash, or smash, or is that the back air? Does that consider the back air? I have no clue. Yeah, what button is a back air? Because wouldn't it just be down air? Oh no, oh, nice, we connected it. Yeah, we got him, take that, Ridley. Take that, Ridley joins the battle. Very cool. Okay, there's no more for now. We'll have to get uh, the Fire Emblem character and Wario some other time. So, I guess I could go hop back onto line, on, onto the online mode. Uh, I can't move the controller. What happened? Oh, cannot connect to the internet. Let's try that again. Because I think I accidentally pressed cancel. 
So let's connect and see if we can't kick some butt. <laughs> That'd be pretty good. Okay, so for whatever reason, it won't let me connect to the internet on Smash. I just checked, everything is fine. So I don't know if uh, maybe there's like a server update going out or something. That's totally cool. I mean, at this point, honestly, I really enjoyed doing the Spirit Board last episode. I think that I might do some more of it. It was a lot of fun, and we already have the dice block, but I might as well get more stuff. Oh, and Mr. L, ooh, I love Mr. L. I don't know which one. We should probably get as many dice blocks as we can, seeing how they are going to be a bit rare. And can I, yeah, let me choose Captain Falcon. And we'll go at this and hopefully things will turn out well. We'll try to do this for like 10, 15 minutes and hopefully it'll be a good time. And maybe we'll even run into more challenger battles because that was something, we played a lot of that. We got like three or four challenger battles last episode that was pretty cool. Um, we need to get something that'll give us an advantage. And if that's it, then that's it. Okay, so items will be pulled toward the enemy. Certain items will appear in large numbers. So we already got, oh yeah, I remember this one. So let's see how we do with this with Captain Falcon, already hitting both of them. And you see, he hits so hard, it's amazing. Mmm, get out of here! And then try that again? Oh, I almost got him. Oh, ooh, ooh, we are tearing him up. Now what are you doing? See ya! That was easy peasy! Can't we see more of that? <laughs> I loved it! Okay, now we gotta actually do the blaster. Easy. So we got ourselves two dice blocks though, so we can start summoning some of those. That'll be cool. So we got improved escape. Always nice to see. Rewards increased, of course, for it being an event. That is awesome. I'm so glad. Can we get more progress like that, please? Okay. So that's a, well, Kiki, this is from Yoshi. Yeah, that's cool. Okay, that's cool. It's not part of the event, though, oddly enough. So I'll focus on the event ones for now and do the other Mario ones after that. Uh, Super Mario Series, Bullet Bill, Captain Falcon team. Okay. Certain items will appear in large numbers of enemies, easily distracted by items. And we're taking Gallon Captain Falcon as Captain Falcon. I mean, he definitely hits like a bullet bill. Sure, let's just try this. Fire and explosion attack up makes sense. Captain Falcon really does hit like that. Like, like he does hit with fire explosion type damage and stuff. Oh, I have one of these. That was maybe a mistake. Oh no, it was fine. Oh, give me the, no, that was mine. Darn it. Where am I? I'm over here. I'm getting myself mixed up with the other Captain Falcons. That's a problem. That was messy, <laughs> that was really messy. Okay, whatever. Of course the bullet bills were everywhere. So let's try the Mr. L. This is pretty cool. The stage is covered in fog. Uh, the enemy's favorite spe special moves, the enemy's FS meter charges more quickly. Of course he's taking over Luigi. We do need to uh, change things up, right? I mean, maybe. Fog immunity probably a good thing with uh, Detective Pikachu there. Okay Luigi, I've yet to play you, but I know you're going down here. Ready? Hey, hey, don't hit me with the green fire. Hmm. Oh, oh, hold on. See ya. Oh, that was good. Oh, man, I love it. It's so cool. See ya. <laughs> That's it. That is it. That was amazing. So we're not to Mr. L. I mean, hopefully, come on. Dang it, I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, I didn't mean to do that, so we're just gonna try again. Oh, it's, it's moving faster now. Oh, no way. <laughs> I'm so bad. You only get one other, the other shot at it. Oh, that stinks. I can't believe I messed it up that bad. Oh, well. Okay, so we got the maximum of spirit board targets has increased. Oh, very cool. So seek out a bandy target 30 times. Pretty cool with that one. Uh, let's get back into it if we can. I mean, I don't, it says max number. I mean, it doesn't look like any of the slots or maybe there's one more slot. Ooh, off the hook. They sound cool. Of course, I know that they're cool, what am I talking about? Hostile assist trophies will appear. Gotta be careful about that. Let's just do this. Do whatever the game wants me to do. Just get into it. This could be cool. Of course we uh, have the off the hook amiibos. We showed those off in our Splatoon series. They are very cool. Ready, oh. I don't know if we've seen this version of uh, Moray Towers. This is pretty cool as well. Oh, it's the Squid Sisters. <laughs> They're not quite uh. What's it called? Uh, off the hook. I guess, I mean, off the hook is sort of, refer you know, being referenced here by uh, the two Inklings. Don't you hit me with that flower. Ooh, whoop, see ya. Okay, ready? And then, I'm trying to uppercut you here. It's not working out so well. Here we go, here we go. Oh, I missed it just barely. It's so stinking satisfying when you can land it though. Oh gosh, wait, wait, wait. What just happened? That was so awkward. I was slipping all over the place. I don't know if Ink makes you do that, but I'm the worst. I really am. Ooh, ooh, I think I know who this is. 
It's Kirby's uh, biggest nemesis, Ping D to D. Oh, oh, dodge it. Oh, nice hit. No, not happening, buddy. Sorry. Watch it. Hmm. Whoop. And then, watch it. Watch it. No. <laughs> Come on. What are you doing? I'm winning this one. I, I've lost too many battles today. Come on, come over here, see what happens. I miss, that's what happens. Oh, how did that not land? Come on. Nice, okay. He's coming back. Oh, and I missed it. No, ooh, be careful. That was beautiful. Hmm. Probably shouldn't use it as much as I'm trying to use it here. There we go, and then, there we go, that was beautiful. Wait, he's not done. He's coming back. Oh, I missed him too. That's just embarrassing. Come on, I just need to hit him like once and I'm fine. That was good. I really like the down air. I mean, it's tough to land, you gotta be really good at it. He's at 180, how high of a percentage are you gonna get at? Dude, this isn't cool. There we go. No, he's still fighting. Stop! Why, that's not fair! I don't care what per that is not fair. You know how many times I hit him like that and he just kept going up 200%? The game is so evil to me today. We're doing Fox Luigi. I don't wanna hear nothing more about it. What is going on with the game today? Just in general, I don't get it. <laughs> my oh my. Jeez. I'm just, I'm flabbergasted. 200%, I've never seen that in a normal battle before. Okay, no, Luigi, I'm gonna smack you with that. I don't like this one, I probably should have chosen different, uh, you know, I really should have chosen different, I didn't even think about it. <laughs> I was so upset about King Dedede being total baloney. <laughs> oh my gosh, oh, I want this one, it's Flint. Let's go ahead and change our team so it actually works this time. There we go. If there's lava floor immunity, must mean that the floor is lava. Flint is so cool. I love him. He's from Mother 3. I love the song too. Can we hear this song while we're, we're fighting? I think so. Yep. Okay. Oh, and he's with Lucas. That's cute. So I am immune to lava floors, so we should be good with everything. It's just sort of a normal fight. Two versus one still, but. What do you think you're doing? I didn't hit you with that, really? I was. That was better. It's like, it's just funny because the ones I've won, I've really won, but the ones I've lost, I've like really lost, you know? Sort of shows you what kind of fighter Captain Falcon is. Ooh, that was good, that was real good. See, like when that happens, it's so cool. What are you doing, get out of here. Okay, so there's that done. And, come on. Not messing this one up. Too gosh darn easy. We get Flint, cool stuff. Okay, so there's that done. Level nine in total for uh, the Metal Gear. Okay, so we got the dice block back. Well, let me go ahead and do the Luma, the Hungry Luma first. Even though I think the last time I tried this, I got my butt totally kicked. Not this time. I'm playing as Captain Falcon. Why would I want to play Slash Man when I could play somebody who has more than one slot? Because the game doesn't like that idea. All right, then I'm just gonna go with what it suggested in the first place. Uh, ah, here we go. Maybe this will work, maybe it won't. Uh, it just says to take your strongest team into the Snow Frills battle, so you think we would suggest my highest level strength character, but no. Okay. Ooh, not bad. Trying to avoid, you know, the Kirby, represented to be a hungry Luma. Why can't I move? I could not move there, that was weird. I'm a little concerned. Hmm. There we go, sending you flying, and then, hmm. Oh, I just hit the Luma, I sort of feel bad about that. Oh, get over here, see what happens. See what happens if you get over here. I miss, gosh darn it. Mm, how did that miss? I don't know, well I mean I guess I can sort of tell that it was a little too far. I was trying to do side special there. You know what then? There we go, I'm gonna keep throwing those at you. Okay, hmm. Oh, yeah, okay, I got you. So it's just Kirby. Come on, come on. Get out of here. How far can you go? This is the King Dedede situation again. No, 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 
No, not allowed. Not allowed. There, see? It's all it takes. You're still here. You're still here. <laughs> what is with this game? It just doesn't like me. Oh, see ya. Okay, well he took himself out, which is, at least that makes me feel better. So, we should be able to get this one. There we go. Hungry Luma it is. Very cool. Okay, so I didn't read that. Let me actually inspect that real fast. Uh, extends the amount of time transformation items like uh, Super Mushroom take. Okay, that's good. I like it. Do we have any uh, extra battles? I'm gonna keep going until we get another uh, champion battle or fighter battle, whatever it's called. So let's make sure that we have everything set up for this. Uh, I do want somebody two slotted. Sure. Okay, because we're used to this when we've done it before, we can do it again. And we did it real easy last time too. All right, mm, not bad. Wait, that was pretty bad. And then charge up. Oh, I missed, I missed my Falcon Punch. Okay, I missed that one, it's okay. Not missing that. And then, oh, blue shell, it's a blue shell. I don't like it. Mm. Oh, I dodged it though, look at that. <laughs> Whoa, 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 hold on, hold on. How did that not hit you? Oh, because the platform got in the way. Oh, see ya. And then, no, hold on. Let me take, oh, oh, a metal. Oh yeah, that was the metal Mario thing. That makes sense. Oh, I wanna throw these. There we go, it's going for uh, Mario, of course. Oh, he's metal as well. I'm gonna dodge that. <laughs> okay. Oh, that missed you? No, no, no! I jumped! Oh man, this game really knows how to do that, doesn't it? Jeez. Okay, let's try something else. Oh, this is an event one. It's a blooper. I'm so, so flabbergasted by this game sometimes. It's ridiculous, it's crazy ridiculous. All right, it's so a time battle. Gravity is reduced. The enemies tend to avoid conflict. Hopefully we'll be able to do this then. Because we gotta do, defeat them all in a minute 30, which is funny because the last thing that bloopers do are avoid conflict. They go right for you in the Mario games. They're like the worst enemy ever. Okay, but they're just floating around as if they're in water, I love it. They're actually tough to hit. Well, it wouldn't be a blooper without it being menacing in one way or another. How did you dodge that? <laughs> get out of here, I can't actually hit them, they're too small. I just gotta get these three, right? Or is there gonna be more of them? No, it's, it's just these three. Okay, that's fine then. That should be real easy. Mmm, see ya. Okay, there's just this one last one left, and he's helpless to my up special. See ya, that was good. Okay, so with that one done, we're gonna bust this open. Yeah, that's easy. Thank you, blooper. You're mine now. Didn't have a blooper before, so that's nice to have. Well, actually, what is it? Ward's increased, yada yada. Um, weight down. Gotcha, that's a primary, pretty cool. I'll take it. Still no battle yet. We'll go ahead and do this guy. It's a uh, Donkey Kong Barrel Blast Kip. Uh, Tiny Yoshi team, the enemy starts the battle with a rocket balance. Sure, that shouldn't be too bad. Okay, let's get to it. It's only four of them. Honestly, that shouldn't be so bad. I don't know anything about Donkey Kong Barrel Blast, to be honest with you, so. I mean, I can sort of see the similarity between the characters, but is there more than one Kip? Why is there four of them? I don't know. It's prob probably referencing something. I just don't understand. Okay. Mm, that was pretty good. And then, dodge that. Oh, I see. So he, you can change his direction of his, you know, Falcon Punch, but it is quite odd to do it that way. All right, you know what, I'm gonna, this isn't a time battle. I'm sort of, sort of used to the timed battle situation. I keep on thinking like, oh gosh, I gotta beat him quick. Luckily, I can take my time. Oh, that was good. All right. Oh, I just barely missed him that time. Can you guys stop this? That was good. Oh, that was real good. Nice. Stop that little Yoshi. No way. Oh, thought he was gonna turn me into an egg and throw me off the edge of the stage there. Like I always try to do as Yoshi. I never succeeded doing it. Can you stop that? Mm, there we go. There we go, he just was backing up into me, might as well. Awesome. 
Okay, so will this be bad? Nah, it's fine. Okay, we got it. <laughs> we unlocked Kip, he has jump up, he's a primary defense, pretty good. Can we get a new battle yet? Uh, No, not quite. I'm gonna keep going until we get it, or at least maybe I will. Maybe I'll just go for like one more. Who do we wanna go for? Let's go for Rapid Ash. Uh, the enemy breathes fire. We should be able to handle this. Let me go ahead and like change that. Franklin Badge is always good. Cause that'll basically protect us from most things. Have we done this before? Maybe. Because it seems familiar. The fast Charizard being able to just like totally beat him up. Nice. Okay. Oh, that missed. Okay, it's fine. Because I can block all that curry. There you go. See, already got him. Like how easy is that? <laughs> 0% damage taken, we should be able to get this. Yeah, that's not tough. Awesome stuff, Rapid Ash is cool. And they get speed up, that's a primary for us. I don't know if we have any repeat primaries. Would be cool to get some at some point. Okay, so with that done, oh, oh, this is an event one? What is this, Super Mario Series Wanda? What is Wanda from? Not entirely sure. Defeat the main fighter to win reinforcements will appear after an enemy is KO'd. Maybe it's like a Mario Bros. 2 thing? Can we get something better than this? There we go. Sure, we'll try it, we'll see how things go. I'm not, I'm still not really a big fan of lipstick, but we'll try it. Cause this doesn't hit very hard. But Tiny Palutena, I mean maybe it's a Super Mario 3D World thing, but I don't know, it doesn't really seem like it with that art. Okay, can you stop that? So apparently as soon as we KO these two, two more will show up. Whoa. Or maybe it's just that I gotta defeat her, which apparently is going to be a bit of a challenge. That was nice though. Mmm! Is that gonna be it? Okay, that's victory. See, we, all we had to do was defeat her. And we did it! Pretty good. And we got that. Okay, we've been getting a little bit better with that. I mean, it has been pretty easy the last couple ones. Slightly increases the power of magic attacks, such as Zelda's and Robin's spells. Oh, cool. Well, there we go, we get Wanda. And level eight for Lakitu, level nine actually, not bad. We got Lakitu in the event last episode. Ooh, one of my favorites! One of my favorites from Bra, And from Mario Kart DS. <laughs> it's Rob! Some people apparently really don't like Rob. I don't, I don't see how that could even be possible. Oh gosh, oh there's bombs. I guess it was like, one of the old NES, where am I? Oh, I'm in a barrel. This is weird. Get me out of here. Nice. It came out kicking. And then, oh, how did that not land? Must have just barely dodged it, but you're not dodging that one. Nice, ooh, that was really nice. Oh, no, I missed it, that's fine. Cause I'll just land something here. Oh, you dodged that? Oh, I was trying to do an up special there. And he was and like Cat the Fuck was climbing up the ladder instead. Not what I wanted. Whoa, this is getting nasty. No, no, no. Hold on, hold on. I can't see anything. Can we just like get back down here? Perfect. That was a really good up special. And we get Rob. He joins the battle. How cool is that? Ooh, we got Bowser. I gotta keep going. There's so many good ones. What is this? Chibi Robo. Oh, cool. I haven't played Chibi Robo. There's so many good ones, but I'm starting to run late on this episode, so we probably gotta wrap it up with that. I do wanna really quickly take a look at our collection and see if we can't dismiss a couple that maybe we have duplicates of, because it should already be, it's not. Um, let me go ahead and order it by number obtained, high to low. Uh, that's not true. Uh, <laughs> what is going on? Yeah, why is, this is not by number obtained. By rank, by level. But I, I definitely have more than one of the, the dice. I thought I did. Suppose I did not. Odd. Well, no, 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 maybe I'm, I might be wrong. Because it doesn't tell me. I thought that more than one would be listed. Where does it say number of owned? It doesn't. Okay. Details. It doesn't tell me anywhere how many I have. I think that'll just be like, there'll be two of them here. 
I don't know. I swear I had more than one of at least a couple of spirits, but I'm guessing I'm wrong. Anyways, the last thing we'll do in today's episode is we will actually go take a look at his taunts and a little bit closer look at his final smash and then go to his vault page and take a little bit of a look at that too as well. So first off, let's take a look at that new, that new final smash, what am I talking about? Just a final smash, but still, taking a look at it, we'll see how things go. Defeating Boss Galaga, it's possible to defeat the Boss Galaga, he'll turn blue once he's taken enough damage. Ooh. Okay, so we're going against Pokemon Trainer. Uh, do our items, do this, and then, there we go. So we get to do this, and a, a, like a, one will fly in right in front of him, and then he'll just go for you. How cool is that? Not too much damage, to be honest with you. That missed, okay, whatever. So let's take a look at his taunts. If we do left, his voice is so weird, come on! That's weird, his up taunt is just him charging up. I mean, I guess it's supposed to make it look like he's about to, and then last one. Yeah, let's get closer. Show me your moves, I like it. All right, well that's everything I wanted to show here so we can quit training. Still very cool. And let's take a look at that vault page and see what other info we can get from that. But yeah, that's basically it with Captain Falcon. Sorry I couldn't play online with him. Would have been a lot of fun, but if I can't connect, I can't connect. But still, I had fun with him in spirit mode, even if we messed things up. Ooh, I'm gonna do this challenger approaching for another showcase. I've, I've done too much today. It's already like a 40 minute episode. Uh, let's go ahead and go to our tips and fighters and get to Captain Falcon. Let's learn a bit about him. But yeah, he's one of the last few N64 characters we have yet to check out. Next one is Jigglypuff, and then if we can eventually get Luigi, that's all the N64 fighters. Captain Falcon's Origins. Captain Falcon's first appearance was in the SNES launch title F-Zero, released in North America in 1991. You couldn't see him in the game itself, but he was in the manual. <laughs> so like, that's what I'm talking about, how crazy is that? He wasn't even in this first game, but look at how big of a character he is in Smash. In his series, he's the main character of the F-Zero series, known for being a skilled bounty hunter. He's also an exceptional pilot and racer of high-speed F-Zero machines, Captain Falcon's machine. The Blue Falcon racing machine first appeared in the original F-Zero. Captain Falcon uses it in Smash Brothers for his final smash. Turn around and attack with Falcon Punch, neutral special. After pressing the attack button, quickly turn around to make Captain Falcon unleash an even more powerful attack as he turns. Oh, interesting. So turning will actually make it hurt more. Raptor Boost, his side special. Uh, used in midair, his hands have a his hand has a meteor effect on the downswing. The trick is to hit the foe when they're below Captain Falcon. Interesting, Raptor Boost Technique side special. Grant super armor at the beginning of the move if, if performed on the ground. Dive into opponents with Raptor Boost and then follow up when they're floating in the air. Continuous Falcon dives, up special. A leaping grab that sends the opponent flying with explosive force. If it connects, you're free to use the same attack again without landing, that is cool. I could see myself using that. Falcon dives direction up special. Uh, press left or right the moment Captain Falcon crouches to adjust the angle of the attack. By holding forward, you can greatly increase the range at which you can grab any enemies. Very cool. Um, Falcon kick is his down special, of course. Um, the attack is at its most powerful right after pressing the button and loses power as it goes. However, it loses less power when it is used in the air. Gotcha. I didn't know you could use it on the ground. Blue Falcon is his final smash, of course. The summon Blue Falcon hits an opponent and sends him flying to an F-Zero course. There, Captain Falcon rams his beloved vehicle into an opponent at high speed, launching them into the air. Very cool. Blue Falcon animation final smash. Depending on if it is used in the air or on the ground, Falcon's pose after striking will change. Of course, he won't be happy if he didn't hit anyone. <laughs> Wheel kick, kick is his up tilt attack, which we've done a couple times. Falcon, if Falcon's heel yeah, heal hits an airborne enemy during hit this attack, it will dunk them. Try standing on the edge of the stage and using it on an opponent uh, trying to grab the ledge. Gotcha, knee smashes his forward air attack. There's a violent knee jab at the start of this move. Connect with that for some serious launching power, and then finally the overhead kick his up air attack. Uh, it's easy to use this move with a combo of combo or as a diversion depending on the hit. You may be able to connect it with a forward air or down air attack to secure a KO. So there we go, there's all the info we can possibly know about Captain Falcon. I love him, definitely one of my favorite fighters so far, but I would love to hear your thoughts on him. Do you think he's good, bad, or somewhere in between? Of course, if you have any tips for me, 
with him. Be sure to let me know about it. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. If you want to support the video, make sure you comment Zebra Falcon. So many have watched at the end of the URA Zebra Tastic Viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Out of the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.